hello everyone welcome to my channel cat tutorials for beginners and in this tutorial we will create a so wheel like structure here so which has a tooth available so let us uh, start with the part design in katia v5 so we go to the part and we will create this profile on this front plane so select the position sketch select the front plane and so now I uh, will create this profile for that uh, this there are two construction lines construction circles are given one is of 40 diameter one is of 32 diameter so let us draw that first so draw this two circles here first is 32 and second is of 40 so make this sorry make this point coincidence first here select the point and select this point and make it coincidence and now so we'll first create one profile here so this is the 23 diameter radius is given for this curve so we'll just create this vertical line first so select this point and select this point so the, our vertical line is created and now we'll create the profile so there is nothing is mentioned here angle or anything so we'll just create some approximate angle over here Or simply we'll create this uh, drawing so let us draw this circle of 23 radius so let us add 46 and make this point coincidence with this make this top point and this circle as coincidence after that so try making this tangent so make this tangent here and just with a trim command trim this unwanted portion here make these two circles as construction line and now we will add a radius here the radius is of 0.5 mm or 0.6 it is not clearly showing so we have taken this image on the from the google for the practice purpose just select this two edges and make it to make it to continuous line and provide this radius 0.5 So now we will make, make a pattern of this, there are total 6 number of tools, tooths, so just select this or maybe, yeah, so take this angle some approximate, let us say 30 and we will trim this entity as well trim this and then exit the workbench so no need to exit this actually we will make a, make a sketch pattern with the help of rotate command so select this sketch here and with the rotate command select the center select the center here select this reference point and add 6 instances and add the angle between them so for this you will get the 6 number of so 
so here we'll make use of that quick trim option so trim each of this entity here actually play with these options and you can take your own dimension and make a part here so I think it is done yeah so now just exit this workbench or maybe you can first check the sketch analysis and in the geometry you will get some implicit profile which is open here because of some circles so make this make them unwanted as a construction so we will get the implicit profile and then exit this so make a pad we'll make a mirror pad so let's add a 3 mm of the say 4 mm just click ok so now this gear wheel is created and now we will create this uh, hub and all so which is 12 mm diameter and this is 6 mm through so again sketch on this or maybe you can use the whole command here just select the not for the pad purpose so we will first create this pad just select the fade sketch not sketch actually we will select the plane so that we can mirror this pad so it is uh, 512 so provide the dimension of diameter 12 then exit this workbench and we have used this as a 4mm so for both the side it becomes 8 as it is a mirror so we will add a pad here again in the mirror fashion and make it 5 and then click ok so now you can see 1mm is added on the both the sides and now we will make a hole throughout of 6 mm diameter so select the hole select this face and just drag it outside and then make a position sketch pick this point and this point as a co coincidence and then exit this so add the diameter is 6 mm and you can select here up to next or blind so you need to provide the dimensions so up to next I will check and just make a preview so you will see the hole is created and then just click ok so again uh, you can uh, create this with the help of pocket command as well we will just make this edges on so in this way you can create this gear wheel so you can provide the um, fillet C or chamfer here just select the chamfer select this edge select this edge not 1 mm actually it will not take 1 mm so let's say 0.2 and then click ok similarly here we add these fillets so add these fillets here at the bottom of again 0.1 mm and then click ok 
so in this way you can create this tooth fill thank you very much for watching and please like and subscribe my channel for more videos